Hi, 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 hi. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Chandra, and today I'm going to show you how do we put in three periods of recess for three different classes, which is shorter than the normal period, and we are going to ensure that the teacher does not clash during these times. See, a lot of schools are having uh, center 1 to center 2, one recess, center 2 to uh, center 3 to center 4, another recess, and center 5 to center 6 uh, is another recess. So now the recess is 20 minutes, and these 20 minutes they might clash with teachers teaching other levels, teaching into the lower levels or upper levels. So they may have a clash. So what you can do is first you have to set the the period uh, recess is set at period 5, period 6, and period 7. Okay, so period 7, after this, click close, go to relations click advance click advance choose maximum consecutive periods and choose two so you want two consecutive periods remove all the ticks from all the days only choose five six and seven these are the periods, 5th period, 6th period, and 7th period. Okay, click OK. Click OK. And you test. Once testing is successful, click OK. And you start your timetable generation. Voila! So, timetable successfully generated. And if you look at the fifth, sixth, seventh, so fifth and sixth, there's a gap. Fifth and sixth, there's no class. Fifth and sixth. 5, 6, 7, 5, first one itself, there is a gap. So if you go through all the classes, you will see the 5, 6, 7, they must have one gap. You see? So this will ensure that your teachers do not uh, clash during the class. Right. Thank you very much.